Hi, I'm Ron. I'm Christy. And I'm Dana. And we're Nightwing. We want to invite you to the Monument Square Art Fair at Festival Hall in Racine, Wisconsin. Never know how much I love you. Never know how much I care. When you want to go somewhere special, come to the Festival Hall by the square. We got the art fair. In the morning, art fair near the Monument Square. Artist Festival Hall, art fair, and we'll see you there. Lights up the daytime Artists decorating the hall I light up with the colors I see And you know I'm gonna have a ball We got the art Hey, I'm Terry Hunt I'm a woodcarver, whimsical woodcarver This is my good fishing buddy Fred And he's one hell of a fisherman As you can see never comes home empty-handed. Monument Square is the oldest art fair in Racine. As Mark Paffrath sings in the background, these three fine young ladies enjoy the music and the atmosphere here at the Monument Square Art Fair. Hello, my name is Jessie Fritch and I am an encaustic artist. Encaustic is an ancient painting method developed over 2,000 years ago by the ancient Greeks um, and I heat up pigmented beeswax and then paint with it hot. Bill Reed is the artist in residence at the Prairie School in Wind Point. On several occasions, Bill has been a Monument Square Art Fair award winner. Bill creates steel sculptures that are colorful, whimsical, and unique. I turn the heat on until the steel talks. Meet Bill at the Monument Square Art Fair. Monument Square. Monument Square. Art Fair. Art Fair. By the lake. By the lake. And then say, for goodness sake. For goodness sake. For goodness sake. Hi, Roberta. Are you going to go to the Monument Square Art Fair this year? <laughs> My name is Jean Wells. I'm a potter from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Um, when you come to my booth, you'll find a uh, handmade stoneware, distinctive in the way that I, um, I do what's called slip carving or scraffito. We have over a hundred artists. Hi, I'm Pat Croth from Verona, Wisconsin, and I create contemporary art quilts. Featuring dozens of media. Hello, my name is Rafi Ballian. I'm from South Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Started uh, photography a few years ago, mostly focusing on like abstract cityscape type photography. Festival Hall is the picture postcard setting on the lake. I'd say beautiful. I'd say picturesque. And I'd say... I'm getting the art fair fever. <laughs> it's a fever. <laughs> you will be amazed at the variety of art and artists. Anderson and Boltwright, Don and Ed Danowski all there. Thieves and Bell and Copen. Meet us near the Monument Square, we got the art fair. In the morning, I've been near the Monument Square. Monument Square is the oldest art fair in Racine. Since Bob Dylan was 20 years old. Of course, you all know that's 1962. Bob Dylan? Monument Square means the finest of fine art. When you kiss me, fever when you hold me tight. Fever. My name is Lisa Larson and my company is Venus Rising. Um, I've been designing and creating jewelry for about 12 years, and I create one-of-a-kind designs. This is the best place to get some of the best art is at these art fairs, because oftentimes once it's gone, it's gone. Because we have an idea, and then we make it, and there it goes. We definitely have fine art. It's a lot of fun. Keeps me out of trouble. To capture your heart. One of the amazing things about the Racine Monument Art Fair is the fact that it's on a great location on the lake. You have a real cross-mix of artists and you have a group of people that come down and enjoy what they're doing and you have a lot of people from the community that come down and browse people that probably would never go to an art gallery all their lives and that's really what makes this art fair a great fair to be in. 
What a beautiful day for an art fair. As we look around and we enjoy this crowd, we enjoy this music and this fine art, it's a great place for you and your family to come and spend a day, spend an hour, spend some money. Oh, can I say that? You too can rat cool. Vanderlease and Riccio. Vanderlease, Reed and Riccio. Now Johnson, William, Madsen too. My name is Margaret Hall, and I work with uh, Fine Fusion Glasswork. Each of these pendants is about 20 hours of working time. I start with a specialized base glass, and I import glass from all over the world. But the base glass has an iridescent property to it, and then you're going to see, um, when you're out in the sunshine, uh, even greater uh, levels of colors of the rainbow above and beyond the obvious, or I should say beneath the obvious. Hi, I'm Dick Helland. I'm a uh, transparent watercolorist and this is probably my sixth or seventh year. We have fine art to capture that. My name is Al Sievers and I've been a full-time stained glass artist for 30 years now and what makes the work unique is the use of different opacities of glass as well as some sculptural aspects that we add to it that creates depth and gives it a more modern and uh, contemporary look. I'm Lisa Berry and this is my husband Chris and we do all these hand-woven tapestry pillows and wall hangings and footstools. I think that what's unusual about them is that all of my background yarns are hand-spun and then I dye them by hand in a little kettle batch. We really <laughs> appreciate being here. It's a wonderful show and they treat us really well. Yes, indeed. Hi, my name is Carol Sunquist. I'm an artist of floral paintings. I, I do um, oil and acrylic. Oftentimes I start with acrylic and, and complete my paintings with oil because I like the glow that it gives. Oftentimes I put prayers on because that's who I am. We have over 100 artists. My name is Cal Wetzel and I'm here at the Monument Square Art Fair. What I've got here today is a hand hammered product. Um, heated up the old-fashioned way in a coal forge. Uh, sometimes we use a gas forge. It's all hand hammered the way they used to do for centuries. Um, just kind of added a more artistic uh, flair to what I do here and make some unique pieces. Hi, I'm Barb Pulowski. I'm, uh, I live nearby in Franklin, Wisconsin, a suburb of Milwaukee. I'm an enamelist and I also do patchwork boxes and I incorporate the enamels into the boxes. Um, sometimes people walk by my booth and they call me the cat box lady because I Cats are really popular and I do a lot of cats. Hi, I'm watercolorist Don Riccio and I will be in the big tent in the tornado safe zone and look forward to seeing you there. Jewelry and photographic art are two of our most prolific media. The art fair offers an incredible variety of exotic handmade jewelry. Hello, I'm Mallory. I carry a line of jewelry called Mallory Gallery, and I will be at Monument Square Art Fair. Hope to see you there. You too could raku. Uh, when they come to my booth at Monument Square, they'll see a range of um, raku fired ceramics, everything from plates to bowls to uh, vessels um, to wall hung uh, tiles that I've been doing a lot lately. Also, a bit more sculptural work uh, that includes um, iron work that uh, holds a lot of the ceramic pieces. There will be artists displaying stone and metal. We definitely stone. have fine art to capture your heart. We have fine art to capture the heart. When I found out who is buried in Grant's tomb, which brings up another question. Why do they call it the Monument Square Art Fair? Especially now because it's at the Racine Festival site. That's a great question, Jerry. A lot of people ask that. Seems like the fair outgrew the square. And besides, the, the festival site is such a wonderful venue for a fair. It's covered, it has protection for the artists and for the people coming to the fair, and it's such a beautiful sight set right against the water. Cast a thousand right there with you, we've got, got the art fair. fair. 